See, this is what I'm talking about. This is how out of touch I am. I don't know what's going on in Nigeria, yeah? I, I don't know what's going, literally, like, I just don't, I don't involve myself with what's going on in the outside world. I might see something, but I just won't even, because I'm like, oh, how is that affecting me? You know what I mean? Now, I'm not saying for everyone to be out, I'm just saying, innit? That's why I've, I've, I've heard something's going on in Nigeria, but I don't know what the fuck it is, literally. The reason why, let me say something about the police, yeah, it's going to be a long fucking 10 minutes, I know. The reason why the police don't get much respect in this country is because that people are allowed to take the fucking piss with the police. Because I'm telling you, the Jamaican police don't play around. When I was there nine years ago, one policeman shot a pregnant woman in her head. The woman was like eight months pregnant. You heard me correct. The policeman shot a pregnant woman in the head. What would a pregnant woman, what threat would a pregnant woman pose Why a police don't need to shoot in the head? Did she really have a gun? Maybe. Maybe. I doubt she came at the policeman with a fucking axe. Or a shetty. I couldn't imagine a police woman coming at a policeman with a, a woman coming at a policeman with a cutlass. The police in Jamaica, they don't fuck about. The police in Jamaica have the utmost respect. You know why? Because the police, sorry, not in, in America. The police in Jamaica have the utmost respect. You know why? Because the police in Jamaica are known for shooting people dead on the spot. Just like that. They don't fuck around. If they tell you to come, you better come. Literally. They don't pay, they don't, they, do you know why the police have to, I'm not saying it's right, but, but the, the police have to be like that in Jamaica. Because Jamaica, there might be some bad man in Jamaica, you know. They might there pull out a gun and shoot you like John Wayne. They might there shoot you without aiming. So, the police have to be a certain way in Jamaica because the man them are a certain way. They don't make their behaviour right. I'm not excusing their behaviour, but the reason why the police in Jamaica have more respect than the ones in the UK. Any of you lot don't believe me, please don't do this. Yeah, please don't do this. But I'm just saying, try run your mouth to a policeman in Jamaica. Them man, they walk around with revolver. When I was there, I see a man walking around with a revolver on him waist. Like normal. No, no, okay, too. So you go central London. I see police officers in central London with their guns and that. Uh, every now and then when I'm on the street, like Edmonton or whatever, I see like armed police here and there or whatever. But the police that they walk around with the man got him fucking him Smith and Wesson on him side. The man is just walking around with a magnum revolver, ready for action. Because they know what the people them in Jamaica is like. They zero tolerance in Jamaica. But again, we can't have police officers shooting people dead in the head. But the reason why the people in the England get away with, like like in Jamaica, this would never happen. Remember that fucking idiot who made that video? The man took out his phone. This has been a long fucking 10 minutes, you know. The man took out his phone. Film the police officers. You're a pussy, yo. You're a pussy, yo. You're no. Suck your mum. Suck your mum. And suck your mum. You think that? Let me say something now. I'm a Jamaican. I'm born here. But let me say something right now. Suck your mama is one of the worst things you can say to a Jamaican. Suck your mother. That that is one of the worst things you can say to a Jamaican. I'm telling you right now. If that guy went to Jamaica, they would have shot him dead right then and there. If a man ever pulled out his phone and said, suck your mum to a Jamaican police officer, they would have shot him dead right then and there. Without, pull out a phone in front of a police officer and say, suck your mother. Oh my God. Only in England could that happen. 
that would never. The only way he wouldn't get shot then by a police officer for saying that is if a police officer didn't have a gun. I'm telling you. That would not happen. Forget about the phone. You couldn't even say that anyway. But to publicly humiliate the police officer, obviously, if you're filming it, you go and post it on social media. No police officer is going to let you, going to have that. Tell you something. If, them, if, he, if that guy ever done that to the police officers in Jamaica, they would have butt him in his ass. And then when they done the autopsy, they would have found the phone shoved up him. Yeah. <laughs> The police there in Jamaica don't play around. Now, don't get it twisted, though. The, the English police don't need to be like that, but the English police need a lot more respect, though, man. I mean, I respect the police, you know what I mean, man? At the end of the day, you know, they're, they're, they're putting their life on the line to protect people. See, people only see when the police are doing madness and maybe acting a bit out of line in the UK, but they don't see when the police save people. They don't see when the police have to go down to Woolwich to deal with mad people that want to decapitate and be headman in the street. They forget about that. They forget about when the police officers go to grandma's house after grandma's been robbed in her own yard and she's petrified. They forget about when the police may run into a burning building to save a child when they're not really supposed to. They forget about that. They only see the times when the police are doing stuff when they're not supposed to. And they only show certain parts of the videos as well. A video might be four minutes long, but they only show you 52 seconds. They show a policeman kicking a man in the face. But first of all, my man punched the policeman in his face early in the video, but they don't show that part. Oh, did the police in America have respect? I'd say probably got more respect than the UK police, but I don't know. I don't think they got that much respect. I don't know, man. It's a difficult one. Probably no. If I have to think about it, then I'd say probably no. You know what I mean? If you have to think to yourself, does this person respect me? Then they probably don't, you know what I mean? So I'd say, yeah, they, they, they don't have any respect. 